There's nothing worse than entering the same information over and over again or digging through filing cabinets. The answer is the DoorPack service and installation software designed specifically to plug into your QuickBooks software. Simple to use and easy to learn. Let's take a few minutes during this video to review how the DoorPack service and installation software for QuickBooks can help eliminate the duplication and reduce the stress in your office. Because DoorPack is physically plugged directly into your QuickBooks, finding a customer while they're on the phone is a snap. We can quickly find a customer by first name, last name, by the company name if it's a commercial account, by their physical address, or even by street name or phone number. Let's look for a company by the name of Demuse Market. As I start to type, it scrolls up quickly and finds all of the companies that have the letters DEM from QuickBooks. When I click directly into that particular customer record, we go immediately to full customer history. It's very easy for us to have a conversation with the customer on the phone while we've got their full customer history in front of us. The top half of the customer's history screen has the information that's being pulled over from QuickBooks, including any balance that's due with the convenience of a button here that actually brings a pop-up over from QuickBooks showing the aging from QuickBooks as well as the list of the invoices if we need to look at them very quickly to do a collection call. The bottom half of the screen gives us historical information that's been created as we work with this client using the DoorPack software. Every time we run a service call, do a new install, do a preventative maintenance call, it keeps track of every individual work order for us so we can always click into that to answer a question for the customer. Taking a new service call is very simple by clicking this button. Also, you'll see there's several of the tabs on here, the ability to keep any type of electronic attachments or pictures, have communications and running notes with the clients. All of our contacts are in here, as well as any quotes that we may have prepared for them, the installed equipment that we may have, including any doors, levelers, etc. And if you have the ability to drill down, you can answer questions regarding spring size, etc. Let's go ahead and take a quick service call for this particular customer. Clicking the new work order button here, you'll see that a message pops up and we can pre-customize any messages to help eliminating taking more calls when we have existing balances on the customer or any other type of notes that are important that are popped up for the dispatcher to see. It takes us directly to the call taking screen. And on this screen, we can simply go ahead and indicate the type of a work order it is. In this case, it's not a callback or a new install. We're gonna make this a service call versus a pre-measurement quote perhaps. And then this is a list of the most common reasons why people may be calling. So let's say this is a door stuck open. If you're tracking your different types of advertising sources, Angie List, etc., you can indicate that. And this is going to be the caller notes down here. So the door was stuck open. So we can put more notes down here so that the, the technician has easy access to additional information from the dispatcher. And that is as simple as it is to take a new call or create a new install. We've eliminated all of the double entry, the double writing on paper, rewriting it again on a work order form, uh, writing it perhaps again on a calendar. Everything has been handled in one step, in addition to being able to put that directly out to the calendar board. So as you can see, we've streamlined the whole operation, and eliminated all the possible duplication that you may be going through manually in your office. That service call is now landed in the unassigned column here. All we need to do to assign it to a service technician is click, drag, and drop. And we can drop it at any time slot for that particular tech. We can actually stretch that particular call if we want to block out a certain amount of time. And if we want to send it directly out to the tech in the field to their mobile device so we can do paperless as well to, the, to their Android and or an Apple device, or we can simply send it out as an email or a text message and they can continue handwriting their paperwork on forms in the field. If the client happens to have a question about availability for a different date, by simply coming up here to the calendar, you can click on any particular day that you need to to identify what the availability is. We also have different columns in here that you can pre-set up. Columns like waiting for parts, parts to order, parts are in, needs a quote, perhaps installations that are pending. Taking all that paperwork and duplication off your desk where you may be losing tickets and putting them visually on the board so one or many people in the office have the ability to see the same calendar electronically instead of whiteboards, post-it notes, etc., etc. And let's go ahead and close the job. So from the dispatch board, we can actually close out or finish a job. And to do the billing is very quick and very simple. All we need to do is go back into the office, 
pull that customer's historical record back up, pull up the actual work order. If it was done in the field with a mobile device, the materials and the parts would be recorded electronically from the field and dropped in here electronically. Otherwise, the people in the office have the ability to pull open the QuickBooks items list, put the description of the work performed directly here into the uh, work order register, pick any particular parts that they may have used by reading the, the paper work order that's been sent to them, and again, this would be your QuickBooks items list, recording any labor that the te text may have taken out in the field along with hours and dollars. And then once you've recorded all the parts and the labor line items and the description that was performed on the job, merely click the QuickBooks button and the items that you want to send directly over to create the invoice in QuickBooks will be created for you automatically. And it's that simple to create the invoice in QuickBooks. No duplication from taking the call to scheduling the call to flowing it directly out to the QuickBooks invoice. This concludes our brief overview of the DoorPack service and installation software for QuickBooks. For additional information, visit us online at www.doorpack.com. Or if you'd like to schedule a personal demonstration, give us a call at 800-890-8614.